to the remotest part of northeastern Kenya. series of videos. top of the one of the highest mountain of hill of Lodwa and where you can see a gigantist Jesus spread the hands and uh, I think we're going to name it as well the door to the heaven hills of Lodwa you're going to have been amazed to have the whole capital of the Turkana County at a wide scale. Here there's no hidden open blue sky. I can, it's, it's as if I'm seeing the globe at utterly wider range. See the horizon. It's as if we are on a circle, a ball, something amazing. Really, it's amazing. There's no secret here. So you see, every every secret of Lodwa, what is can be hidden here? You can see the gigantic high heights, statues, open hands, door to the heaven. Lodwa, here we are. Spectacular view. And it's amazing. An epic view of Lodwa at large. It's as if the globe really, when I see it in sphere form, really sphere form with the round ball. Can you see such amazing place? View surrounding lakes, houses, road. I can see Lodwa Air Strip here, but it's empty, no plane at all. About to come, and uh, it may be spectacular to see. Look at it on the Even nicer to fly drones to have really fantastic wide range of Lodwa capital of Turkana County and the hills which is represented. This is really I can name it to become a land landmark of Turkana capital Lodwa. In fact, I can say approximately within a range of uh, say three to four hundred kilometers you may be if you have a good sight far side view you may be able to look at its landmark wherever you go to US theirs are there I think it used to be like this and Lord we say for God help this nation particularly this part of the nation which has a uh, known but it's farming, 
hardship, scarcity, is, is not an option, it's permanent structure. And here we are, really, it's amazing structure. I can see, now look at the desert, mountain, rocks, and on all it, the, the landscape is just amazing. No one such can describe such wonderful epic scenery. It's, it can't get better than this. It can't get better than this. It's amazing. Amazing. Wow. I wish if I was stay a resident of this part of the country, I could be every evening and every morning sunrise finds me here. And every evening, sunset finds me here. It could be my routine's activity because it's just amazing, spectacular, nice to see. It can't get better than this. Even here, if it was an army barracks, it could be bad because no enemy can come with whatever direction because we can just put our artillery ready to fire. Hmm. Spots, amazing. The words is almost fail me. So it's amazing. Enjoy, enjoy the view of a broad view of Lodwa capital of the Beautiful. And it's promising. See how huge it is. See the river flowing in the middle of the capital. Amazing. And Turkana, known by its uh, vegetation, the, the climate change. But look at the green vegetation within here. Amazing. Now we are very soon, we're gonna start now hitting the really, uh, within a couple of days or a couple of uh, few weeks, we're gonna start experiencing now the hardship really, the desert uh, sand dunes, and the really extreme harsh, extreme harsh uh, uh, climates. Very soon we're gonna tackle it, but really it's amazing. Fresh cool breeze here on top of the mountain. Uh, it really, it was also among the, the spot which I was been, we have been dreaming about to reach this spot as well. Because I used to other colleagues and YouTube and other part of uh, uh, platforms used to come stand in the point where I stood. But for us, as we say, we are coming, our mission to illustrate, to captivate, uh, to capture all the necessary history and the magic spot and to try to give it more flavor illustrate it in a more uh, professional way to, to make you feel as if if you even if you've never reached lodwa feel as if you are part of our cruise you also crew together with us not physically but visually here we go this is lodwa i hope you enjoyed cut off uh, maybe maybe amazing Come and maybe look at it on yourself. But we have made what was uh, we have been dreaming about. The dream come true, and here's Lord War. And now we're gonna sign out, go back to our trail, and hit the road where we're gonna have extremely harsh weather within a couple of days. And harsh sand dunes is what we're looking forward to gonna do. And is we love, we love what we're doing. We are so passionate and looking forward to explore more and share with you as usual. Thanks for watching and enjoy the view. Woo! Flying and the, the, the cold breeze is about to end. We are beginning with the hard one. The hard one on the, on the real desert, where you, I'm sure you can see this vegetation, you can't get this cold breeze, but then you get the other way around, you get the hot breeze. So mentally, we are changing ourselves. Physically, we are changing our attire, approach, and each and everything. But despite all that, we are geared up give you all the best and um, hopefully we will of course enjoy you the viewers our followers and us since you sent us to get you what you what you deserve we're gonna do it for you so kindly keep tuned subscribe check on the bell and we keep rolling thank you very much and God bless you
right, here we go. Uh, we are traveling the Kitale uh, Highway, and the other name we used to call it uh, A1 uh, Roads of Kenya. And now the town we are gonna be with it soon. It's called Kitale. Kitale is a town on the northern Rift Valley of Kenya. the focus how many what is the degree when you try to push a hand if you really Them. They are different. <laughs> Maybe it was a. They're still ancient style. It 
who has been inspired by the ant hills. But for them, for us, ant hills still alive. Yeah, normally those things they normally come from the, the yeah. animal lifestyle. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, people learn from that. But still, really, it's not a uh, region to become. Uh, yeah. To have a unique beauty yeah. in terms of there, because I, we have a trouble. But see such things because the ant hills we have in our countries. It's not the same, they tend to fall in there, yeah? but to even make it to have it stand tall, wall, with a little different look. And it is what it is. Apart from the spectacular scenery, the culture diversity consisting of 14 tribes of the northern Kenya, that makes the most lasting impression nomadic pastoralists such as Gabra, Turkana, and Samburu who has adherence to a strictly traditional lifestyle and the dress is practically unique in the modern East Africa. series of videos.